Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can set a page background color or apply a page background fill effect to Word documents to make them more visually interesting. To set a page background color or fill effect in Word, click the Design tab in the ribbon. Then click the Page Color drop-down button in the Page Background button group. In the drop-down menu that appears, you can choose a color from one of the sections. To apply a custom page background color, click the More Colors command to open the Colors dialog box. Then either click the Standard tab and select one of the colors in the Honeycomb of Color Choices, or click the Custom tab to select a color from the Rainbow Gradient, and then use the slider to the right to change its darkness or lightness. Then click the OK button to apply the color and close the dialog box. Alternatively, to apply a fill effect as a page background in Word, select the Fill Effects command from the Page Color Buttons drop-down menu instead to open the Fill Effects dialog box. You can use the Gradient, Texture, Pattern, and Picture tabs within this dialog box to change the settings of the Fill Effect to apply to the page background. To apply a gradient, click the Gradient tab in the Fill Effects dialog box. Then choose a gradient color from the Colors section, and then use any drop-downs and slider that appears to the right of those option buttons to select the desired color, colors, or preset. The Transparency section is unavailable for page backgrounds. Next, select the angle of the gradient from the Shading Styles section. Then choose the specific variation of the selected shading style to apply by clicking it within the Variants section. Alternatively, to apply a texture, instead click the Texture tab and then click the texture to apply from the texture list. Alternatively, to apply a pattern, click the Pattern tab and then click the desired pattern within the pattern list. Then use the Foreground and Background drop-down to set the desired foreground and background colors. As a last option, to insert a picture as a background, click the Picture tab and then click the Select Picture button to open the Insert Pictures dialog box. This dialog box contains three options. To use a picture from your computer, click the Browse button next to the From a File choice to open the Insert Picture dialog box. Then navigate using the Insert Picture dialog box to find and select the local image file to use. Then click the Insert button in this dialog box to finish. Alternatively, to look for an image using the Bing Image Search, type your keyword or phrase by which to find an image into the Search Bing field next to the Bing Image Search label. Then either press the Enter key on your keyboard or click the adjacent Search Bing button which looks like a magnifying glass at the right end of the field to show the results of the image search within this dialog box. Click to select the image to use in this dialog box, and then click the Insert button to finish. Alternatively, to use a picture saved to your associated OneDrive account, instead click the Browse button next to the OneDrive link to show all of your OneDrive folders within this dialog box. Then click a folder to show its contents in the dialog box. If needed, you can click the Back Arrow button in the upper left corner of the dialog box to move back to the previous folder. Once you find the image to insert within your OneDrive folders, simply click it to select it and then click the Insert button in the dialog box to finish. After making your desired fill effect choice within the Fill Effects dialog box, simply click the OK button at the bottom of the dialog box to apply it to your document as the new page background. To remove a page background in Word after applying one, click the Design tab in the ribbon. Then click the Page Color drop-down button in the Page Background button group. Then select the No Color choice from the Buttons drop-down menu to remove any page background color or fill effect. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.
www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.